Dan Leonard is a decorated combat veteran who served as a paratrooper in the U.S. Army's 82nd Airborne Division in Afghanistan. But all of that was disregarded when he crossed paths with the Council on American-Islamic Relations. In fact, his distinguished service was attacked for this. This kind of mockery uh, that was exhibited uh, is very intimidating and you know, not indicative of the kind of nurturing environment we want our children to grow up in. Suze is talking about these. Facebook posts, he says, are racist and anti-Muslim, posted by Dan Leonard, a Toms River Board of Education member. The posts depict two Muslim Congresswomen, Ilhan Omar and Rashida Tlaib. One says, quote, terrorist 100 percent. The other is a repost of an article about Tlaib's potential hunger strike that says, quote, my life would be complete if she slash they die. But Suze says it's the third post that is deeply problematic. It definitely implied that um, she had been the victim of domestic violence and, and was possibly going to be the victim of a stoning, which are some uh, common screeds that people use to uh, you know, defame Muslims. Although the posts are from April, they were brought to CARE's attention just this week. Now Suze says Leonard needs to resign because the posts send the message he says would make any Muslim child in the Toms River School District feel unsafe. Uh, he's, he's not backing down. He's not apologizing. He's not even, you know, insinuating that uh, there's something wrong about it. Um, so, uh, you know, this, the, the Board of Education needs to ask for his resignation. It's dangerous. We're living in very dangerous times right now. Abdul Mubarak Rowe is the communications director for New Jersey's chapter of the Council on American Islamic Relations, which has condemned both officials, warning of dire consequences if this type of rhetoric doesn't stop. These things have extraordinary outcomes because, like, it gives people license to feel that they can go out and commit these acts of violence. He's entitled to his feelings, whether he likes Muslims or not, or any other group of people or not. However, okay. once he is a public official, he needs to make sure that those comments stay within him and they're not projected outwards, okay? And he needs to resign because he's a disgrace. And all of you board members here today, if you don't force him to resign, you're just as guilty you are making this township worse. A member of the Toms River School Board decides not to run for re-election. Daniel Leonard was facing backlash from the Muslim rights group CARE, C-A-I-R. He made a comment about Muslim Congresswoman Rashida Tlaib saying, quote, my life would be complete if she, they die. CARE has called for his resignation ever since. Leonard says he will resign at the end of the year on his terms. If a man like Dan Leonard can be driven from public office, what chance do the rest of us have in standing alone against the Council on American-Islamic Relations?